Nick Cole can do this without much coaching. And, and I've got Tuscan Red under there and one coat. Now this is, remember this product's hard and it was just done last night in my shop. So, and it was done with a brush, you can obviously tell, but she's gonna sit here and Nicole is gonna show us how to distress this piece of wood. She's never done this, am I correct? Never. So I've put her in the spot and then it's kind of unfair, but I think she'll, she'll like this. So she's gonna just start standing where she thinks it ought to be. So let's start doing that. And if you wanna come back here and do it, that's fine. See, you see how it's kind of coming through, y'all? Everybody see that okay? She's making progress. Just getting you an upgrade on that. Yeah. All right, look, here's a serious thing. Do you know the difference between this and this? What is this? It's right, it's all cotton. What is this? Well, kind of, yeah. It's, it's paper towel. It's a, it's a lint-free paper towel. That's important. Scott makes this. They're coming to roll. They're blue. They're about two bucks a roll or buy a big jumbo thing, at whatever. Use these for water base, not for water base, oil base. You can use this for oil base, but th these absorb a lot better than this. And for water base, this does a lot better, okay? All right. Is there, can you see the red in it? Of course. Yeah, look here, uh, of, of course. Of course. Artiste. I like the color. I got a cabinet I'm building. That doesn't look too awful bad, does it? <laughs> Come here. Now. No, you're not done. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let me have your product. Now, it's funny. I, pro I wonder how I would have done if I had a, lit one up there first and come back down. They're so close, it's crazy. Can y'all see that? I'm walk around. Okay, that's what it looks like. You see the red kind of coming through. And you see the dull areas. You notice there's some dull areas. Now, watch what happens next. Is that yours? How'd you know? More was off of it. Okay, now. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. Now I've already started. I'm not going to waste y'all's time and mine again. And this can's been used a little bit. Okay. Your weapon. All right, y'all right, share the can. Okay. What we're doing is putting on a clear top coat of the high performance satin. Okay, and I'm I'm going to critique their their abilities here. I think she, you're both going to be good. I can tell. But but the key to this stuff is. Not too thin and definitely not too thick, but it does self-level. So I'd rather have it a little thick than too thin because too thin it's going to drag. A brush really drags. They're sitting here looking at their work, and this lady here is seeing, I think, on the bottom right that it's already drying. Mm -hmm. Is it not? Yeah. And, and that, that, remember that dullness after they've been rubbing on it? And I'm going to show you something. I'm going to take yours. Mm -hmm. It's already drying. So, put it on so thin and put probably. A little both, yeah, but more thin. See how it's, it's that dullness is gone. That's just one coat. Now, when she puts on, or she's not going to do it today, we're not going to have time. But when you put on two or three coats, it, it, it's, it looks outstanding. See how that's doing now? It's just simple. It's simple, I promise you. Okay? Hold up a minute, guys. Huh? Oh, yes. Now, it's very safe. Here's the thing, when, you do, when you're doing baby furniture or food safe, as we call it, um, here, thank you. Um, cure time on oil for it's perfectly safe to eat out of, no matter what anybody tells you, this is gospel because I've read too much about it and Monaghan, these chemists told me this, 28 to 30 days on all oil bases or solvent bases. Water base, 10 days. Okay, there's a curing process that goes on that you don't know about because it's, it's a chemical reaction that's happening, you know. It's dry, but it's not finished. It hadn't cured, totally cured. Once it's totally cured, then it's food safe.